normally I'm tolerant of all other forms of music. I love metal, punk, glam, goth, hard rock, psychedelic, and even some death metal. I'm fine with disco. I can tolerate country if I absolutely have to. I hate mainstream pop and rap, obviously. But if there's one music genre that makes my blood boil, it's fucking dubstep. Yes, sir, I'm now ranting about dubstep. Today in history class, my teacher decided to turn on some music, and he was actually playing really good stuff like Miley Crew, Def Leppard, Guns N' Roses. You know, I, didn't, I wasn't expecting him to have that good of a taste in music, but then again, he's a little older, so why not? But then, of course, my feeble-minded classmates start complaining and that they hate heavy metal, and they need to play some dubstep, because that's real music. No! Dubstep is possibly the lowest form of music out there. I don't even consider it music. For me to consider something music, it should at least take talent at playing a musical instrument or songwriting. All you need for dubstep is money and basic knowledge of a computer. I mean, look at it. Then boom, Skrillex. The only reason that kids my age like it is because they have the fucking attention span of a rodent, and they like catchy keyboard beats, because like, do 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 No, it's freaking dumb. New Wave bands did in the 80s, and that died off really quick. And it's supposedly the cool thing to like right now, but cool is subjective, like Blue May just would say. <sighs> I can really guarantee you that in 5-10 years, that all these mainstream artists like Skrillex, Nicki Minaj, Lil Wayne, Kesha are just going to cease to exist to make room for a new musical revolution, which honestly, we need really, really badly. Or just make room for the next big thing. It's like seeing kids. Do you really think you're going to be dressing the way you do in 40 years or when you're older? I mean, honestly, I, I don't hate seeing kids, just the pretentious ones I hate. And I actually do have a lot of friends that are seeing kids. And even they think they're probably not going to be dressing like that in a few years. They're just doing it because they're young and they, they think it looks good right now. And I'm not singling you guys out. I mean, I'm probably not going to end up dressing the way I do depending on my profession. I mean, if I'm a musician, then yeah, I'm probably still going to dress like this. But if I become like a writer or a teacher or a nurse or anything like that, anything professional, then probably not. I'd probably just class it up a bit. You can't be young and dumb forever. It doesn't last that long. Same thing with dubstep. It's all a passing fad. Not even the dubstep fans in my class were able to come up with a legitimate reason for listening to it. All they could say was, it's awesome. I know not all dubstep fans are like this, but the ones I tend to encounter say the same thing. When they asked me why I thought metal was better, I told them that I'm outspoken and made fun of a lot, and metal speaks more to my lifestyle and it makes me feel more comfortable in my own skin. And it gives me a sense of empowerment, just with the power and the music and the imagery and the lyrics, but they just dismiss my argument right away because I'm going against popular opinion. In a debate, you can't ignore the conflicting opinion. You argue your points in an organized but civilized manner, mind you, and you just hope that they get your opinion, and just so, they, just so the other person can understand what led you to form your opinion. Why is dubstep awesome? They couldn't give me a reason. From their argument, nothing, technically. Either they just didn't have one, or they only like it because their friends told them to. Sorry, I'm reading a lot. I just kind of did a quick script off after a history class. This page, back, and this page, and a little back, but... Pointless. Continuing. Ah, stay up! Frickin' notebook paper! I hate you. And you know, I understand a computer-generated beat can be catchy. I mean, it was pretty much the same thing all throughout the 80s. I mean, Safety Dance, what was that? Boop, boop, beep, beep, boop, 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 beep. Honestly, it was barely anything. But bands like Zeppelin, The Stones, Aerosmith, David Bowie, they put effort, emotion, and creative energy into their songs. And that's why they still have a loyal following today. They still speak to the outcasts in society. They have stay power. Good lord, people. The Rolling Stones are still touring, and it's their 50th anniversary. And they have fans that listen to their music religiously, like me. 
and they still have fans that'll go out and buy their shit, their clothes, their albums. And every dubstep song I've heard sounds the same. It just sounds like someone's barfing on a freaking keyboard. The only dubstep songs with emotion are the ones that they cover with the same lyrics but horribly overdubbed with all this gratuitous keyboard shit. And you can say dubstep is the best music ever, but let's be realistic. You're gonna forget all about it as soon as the next fad comes along. It's happened before it'll happen again. New Wave, Grunge, even Hair Metal. I mean, I personally love Hair Metal like Poison and Rat and Dokken and all that shit. But they went fast as well, even though I love it. Even you dubstep people, you're probably going to end up feeling the same way I do with hair metal. I mean, I love it, but it goes away. And mostly, even though I hate to say it, most of the hair metal acts are nostalgia now. I mean, they still tour, they still put out records, and however, some of them still rock pretty hard in my humble opinion. But dubstep? Just another one of those passing things. You can deny it all you want, but it's probably going to end up that way. I'm sorry. I don't care if I get hate comments for this. I really don't. I just want to get back to where music actually required talent instead of just knowledge around a basic computer and or with iGarage. I don't fucking know. I'm just saying what I'm saying. It's just going to pass. And I can see it coming. Everyone can see it coming. There are a lot of ranters that have already ranted about this, and I'm just kind of jumping on the bandwagon with this. I've had some to get out, and haven't uploaded a rant in a few days, but I don't know, YouTube was being kind of stupid, so maybe I can F with it now, and hopefully this will upload so y'all can see it. And in other music news, um, The Darkness touring with Lady Gaga. If they're going to tour with Lady Gaga, the darkness needs to be the headline act, not Lady Gaga. She should be opening for them. I just hate her music. I mean, I don't hate her as a person, but I just don't like her music. The darkness fucking kick ass, in my opinion. I'll probably, But that's a whole nother rant, honestly, and so is the whole scene kids and style thing. It's just a whole nother rant, so I'll just end here for now, and maybe you'll see some more from me in a few days. Alright, thanks, bye.